All right, welcome to this week's edition of Making the Hot Tag. As you can tell, I'm recording from my room, uh, which we never usually do, unless I'm introducing something to you because we were unable to actually record an episode in Deirdre's place. So that's what we're doing now. Um, and so I wanted to take a moment and introduce to you what you're going to be watching. Uh, as I've said previously, Deirdre and I do a lot of short films together. And uh, this past year, 2021, we actually did two, two short films in a very short span. Uh, both were in May had to be finished and completed in May during the 48 hour film festival. So uh, beginning of May, we had 48 hours to create and, and produce our own film. And at the end of May, we had to do the same thing, create and film uh, a short, a short seven minute film for the 40 hour film festival or the global film challenge. Same thing. Um, so what I'm going to show to you now this week is support group, which is our uh, which was our submission for the global film challenge. Uh, we're pretty proud about this one, uh, namely because it won uh, the judges award for the submitted films for the Boston area, uh, which was awesome. So we had the opportunity to uh, go against other films in the country. Uh, to see who would be the best it turned into an elimination match uh, unfortunately we didn't get past we did not get past that first round however uh, we do were honored that the judges felt we were the best and uh, we were glad to see our film you know be shown all over the country everyone got a chance to watch it so we're pretty stoked about that so um, you know as always I want to thank Deirdre for for being her super script writer director self and I uh, just want to thank the actors who you'll see in this film um, there's several and uh, spending the day with us letting us uh, throw them around as, as we get uh, our vision on digital print or whatever it's called uh, so here it is here's support group thank you and uh, we'll see you next week hopefully in Deirdre's bed that always sounds wrong. Welcome, I'm Katrina Livingston, and I will be the leader and facilitator of this six-week self-help program designed for superheroes who are aging out of the business, and uh, I think we're going to do some great work here. We're going to start by introducing ourselves. As I go around the circle, I'd like you to tell us your name and your superpower. So we are going to start right here on our right. My name is Breeze, and my superpower is speed. Hi, I'm the Stretchinator. Uh... My friends call me Stretch. My superpower is being able to stretch, and I can stretch my limbs, and there's no limit. Hi, I'm Metamorphosis. Uh, my superpower is to rearrange my molecules, change into other shapes, other beings, other things. I can make myself younger. Um, there's no real limit to my lifespan, so I don't know why I'm here. Hi, I'm Daphne. Uh, my superpower is invisibility, and uh, thus my original name, important, diaphanous. I'm Geneva Schmidt, um, better known as Geneva the Gypsy. Um, when I was very young, I found out that I was able to read people's minds just by touching them. Oh, why are you so frightened? Did you just read my mind? So this is probably a good time to mention sort of the house rule about support group. And that's while we're here, we keep our superpowers to ourselves. Hello, my name is Hemo. And I was gifted with superhuman strength. Hmm. Interesting. Metamorphosis, what's happening over here? Want to share with the group? I wasn't completely honest before. I 
I can't change into whatever I want. I try every day to change into Batman, my favorite hero, and I, I just can't. This is the best I can do. And if you wanted me to be vulnerable, there you go. Is there anything you need? Anything we can get you, make you feel a little bit more secure? Um, yes, please. Could could I have another tea bag? I like my tea really strong, and I'm a little boxed in right here. I'll get it. Whoa, that was some stretch. Thank you. Uh, I don't mean to interrupt, but where's Daphne? I'm here. It just happened again. It, I disappear when I get... I got emotional when Metamorphos was talking. Maybe if I ate something, um, a cookie or something, it really helps. Um, I don't think I have any cookies. I can handle that. Here we go, everyone. Where'd those come from? Corner store, no problem. Oh, thank God. Don't mind if I do. Oh my God. Oops. I don't want you to worry about it at all. We'll get it cleaned up in no time. Everybody else, why don't we take this opportunity to have a bathroom break, maybe get some more tea, and when we get back, we're going to get into the real stuff. Okay, welcome back, everyone. We've got, uh, I don't know, another half hour left, so we've got plenty of time. I don't want anybody to worry. I want everybody to feel comfortable because this next part is going to involve digging deep. My instructions are, tell us anything. Anything that's on your mind, just let it fly. No judgment. It's a safe place. Who wants to go first? You know, at the uh, assisted living place where I'm living, um, we're surrounded with people, yet we, we all feel isolated and alone. People my age, they just act so much older than I do, yeah. right? It's, and the young people I don't have anything in common with. There comes a time in your life when you realize you're never going to learn how to speak French or take up skiing or yeah. backpack through yeah. Europe. You know, the best thing about getting old is that you really get to know yourself. Getting older doesn't mean you're getting wiser. Huh. That's bullshit. <laughs> Yesterday, I, I was on the toilet, and when I stood up, I forgot to pull my pants up. <gasps> I thought I was going to kill myself coming out of the bathroom. And my peers, they can't keep up with me, though. Well, to be fair, no one could keep up with you. No, I wasn't talking about that. It's like being... I was talking about the being active part. Oh, death doesn't scare me as much as not being remembered. I'm not an Avenger. Nobody ever makes movies about metamorphosis never mind being remembered i wish i could remember anything mm. yeah. <laughs> last yeah. week i lost my focus and i forgot to stay invisible in the men's dressing room at the gap oh, <gasps> luckily oh i caught a glimpse of myself in the mirror and i faded out you were lucky what were you doing in the men's dressing room i don't remember you don't want to make friends with somebody because, you know, they're just going to die. I wasn't prepared for so many of my peers to die. I just am trying to find the meaning of life. Yeah, just last week, Eternia died. <gasps> oh, my gosh. Hey, you, her superpower was to time travel. Yeah. But she so thinks she could go back in time, but her husband just said she didn't have it in her. I'm a superhero. You can't lose it. Superheroes don't lose it. It's brutal. What, what's going on? Is that what, you? Wait a minute. Shit. It's okay. Metamorphosis. Oh, is, okay. is that you? Yeah. yeah. Is there something you want to share with the group? Uh, this is my real form. I, I, I don't know what happens. Uh, here's a thought. Maybe it's because you feel comfortable here and you're able to show your true self. Oh, I hope so. I think so. Final thought? Just want to end the session with superheroes don't need capes to be super. Trust me, you're all going to be remembered. Do you know what it's like to be pulled over when they can't see you and how many times I've been towed in my own car? 
Does that spandex make my ass look big? If you want to be fast, you have to stay hydrated. Giving a hand job can get really complicated. I, I didn't appreciate my superpower until I started dating.